the 2024 season was positioned as a turning point for Mercedes. After two difficult years struggling with ground effect regulations, Mercedes needed the W15 to deliver a significant comeback. Instead, the first two races of the season have revealed a deeply familiar pattern and one that may already be taking a toll on superstar driver Lewis Hamilton. Mercedes promised big changes, but once again their new car is plagued by balance issues and a lack of pace. These problems are particularly worrisome when considering Hamilton. The seven-time world champion is struggling more than his much younger teammate George Russell, suggesting something might be amiss beyond just the car's performance. A former F1 driver, David Coulthard, has a pointed analysis. He's just not been settled with this car, and you can tell, you know, George is just honing the lap time right now and you can feel that Lewis is on the back foot. Could Hamilton, faced with yet another season of fighting against an unstable car, mentally be preparing for his inevitable switch to Ferrari at the end of 2024? Despite the early season slump, team principal Toto Wolff vows that his team will turn the situation around. He insists Mercedes is working tirelessly to resolve the car's fundamental problems. Hamilton, naturally, deflects any suggestion of mentally being with Ferrari already. I'm 100% a Mercedes driver right now and that's my only focus this year, he insists. The relationships I have with the people within my team go very deep. My goal is to deliver for them this year. And despite his significant contributions to the development of his car through constant feedback to the engineers, Hamilton is currently struggling through his third consecutive winless season in Formula One. This mounting frustration could create a sense of urgency within Hamilton. Could it push him further towards that eventual Ferrari seat? The next race is scheduled to take place in Melbourne later this week. Currently, Red Bull is ahead of Mercedes by a significant margin of 61 points, placing them in fourth position. The championship standings add to the pressure as the reality of the situation becomes more apparent. Whether Hamilton's words should be taken at face value is open to debate. The question remains, are the lingering issues with Mercedes' car in the ground effect era significant enough to permanently sour this once dominant partnership? Will Hamilton's frustration grow as the season progresses? And how much mental energy is he already expending envisioning himself in a scarlet red Ferrari come 2025? Leave your thoughts in the comments below.